Hi, I'm Toby Lee and you're my rock stars in training. My name is Toby Lee and I'm 10 years old. I've been playing for probably about six years now. I got my first guitar when I was probably about four. My grandma bought me a little ukulele. Still play a guitar on it. It's got no strings. My first electric guitar I got when I was six because I still had the ukulele all those years. But the first guitar, proper, proper guitar, was an Evolution guitar. It was black and it sounded really, really good. And I, my first amp that came with it was a little practice amp and they're both very, very good sounding together. I have got an acoustic guitar and I do play acoustic guitar quite a lot. I had classical lessons before I had electric lessons and classical guitar never really clicked with me. I always had a go and one day I came into a lesson and I said, I can play rock guitar and I found a new pick under the sofa and it was a Lego wheel that was a little rubber tire and I said, do you like my new pick? And he said, that's a rubber wheel. That's a rock song. Oh, hardy wordy. Um, I th I, it was Smoke on the Water by Deep Purple. And then it was definitely one that I just picked up from my friend Mick Box out of Your Heap. It was called Nail on the Head. I love the blues. Not as much as my mum and dad, but I love them pretty well. Well, I'll say this. I love them more than myself. Because that's what makes me be this guy. So, yeah. I love the blues, they're cool. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Joe Bonamassa. Probably number one. SRV. Yeah, he's probably number... I'm not sure. There, there's no order to them. I'd say... Joe Bonamassa would probably be top of my list, then the, all of the best guitarists in the world would be under him. But some people say, oh, this guitarist's amazing, and sometimes I don't know who it is. I made a video for BB Kim to wish him better, because he was in hospital that week. He was rushed, because he was really, really ill. And I just put on a onesie, like I normally do for my onesie jam, and... I found a BB King backing track and just let it rip. It was probably about six minutes long and I did it in the style and it just went mad. It got about five million views. It was... Ah! So, yeah. I fell down the stairs when I heard who shared it. Joe Bonamassa shared my video and that's how my likes went from 2,000 up to 27,000. And every single likes poster that I put up had a picture of Joe Bonamassa there. I was like, <laughs> it was from probably about, that one went mad anyway, but when he shared it, it went even madder. It, so it probably had about two million, and then he shared it and went straight to five million the next day. I've created these lessons for sort of beginners or players that don't really understand guitar or, or they've just bought a guitar and they're so excited. I really hope that the beginners and people really, really sort of enjoy them and listen to them and stuff like that. And I, I hope people like them and I hope it all goes to plan. We need more guitar players in the world. There's too many people singing pop. <laughs> Makes my head go crazy. We need more guitarists in the world. That's why I need you. So you're going to be my rock stars in training.